Hi, I'm Stacy Kennedy, registered dietitian, licensed nutritionist, board certified specialist in oncology, certified personal trainer. I'm also a graduate school professor. I'm adjunct faculty at two different colleges within their graduate school nutrition programs. And I've been in private practice myself for over 10 years. I'm really excited to introduce you to Nutrium because it has a lot of features that I feel are very important, especially when you're first launching your practice and getting started. I also feel for myself as a private practice dietitian who does not take insurance that there are many features that are appealing to me as well as a business owner. So I'm gonna take you on a tour now of some of my favorite features within Nutrium. There are so many features within Nutrium that allow you to launch your business in a very easy, simple, cost-effective, and low-stress manner. So I'm gonna show you a few of my favorite features. And the first one is the website and blog. This is an incredibly helpful tool. It is very simple to customize and build out all the details about your business. It's also optimized for SEO where you don't have to figure that out. It can be costly and difficult to figure out how to boost your visibility when somebody is Googling and searching for a nutritionist or dietitian in the area. Nutrium does this for us when we create our website, which is just fantastic. So you can see here, there's a lot of details around personalization that I can add. It also links directly into my social account. So I can, um, the person can be connected to me at Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, or LinkedIn. Uh, they can jump right to see my blogs or recipes. And these are formatted beautifully. All I did was type the information in, the font, the colors, the layout, this all happened automatically, which is amazing and so helpful. Same thing with recipes. It was really simple for me to load in my favorite recipes that I wanna share with my clients. And again, the formatting happens automatically along with this gorgeous layout of the breakdown of the nutrition information like fiber, protein, that is going to be important for for my client. They can book an appointment, they can contact me, they can find out where I'm located, they can choose the type of service. So I've built in the pricing and payment is uh, required to be due at the time of booking, which is actually a setting that you can make, but something that I find incredibly helpful, um, especially when getting started. So the client can select the reason for their appointment, um, they can select other, type it in themselves, they can book something right away. And then there's even a bit of information here to help communicate the value of Nutrium as a client to the client. I didn't put any of this in, it automatically populated for me. Another one of my favorite features about Nutrium is the fact that this whole platform is geared for the professional who is not accepting insurance in their private practice. So somebody who is private pay, and that can happen for a variety of reasons, right? So you might be private pay because insurance reimbursement is poor for the type of services that you're providing. You may not wanna deal with the hassle. There are a lot of reasons that you might be set up as self-pay. So what I wanna show you is that all of the features that are available in the products that are geared towards accepting insurance are right here in Nutrium. Everything you need, but nothing you don't. So you're not paying for or having to try to ignore or deal with a whole component of your platform that you're really never going to use for your business. So for example, I see here that I have an appointment set up for tomorrow. I've integrated Zoom, but I can absolutely integrate other forms of how I'm going to connect with my client. So this also helps the professional who's working remotely, working with clients who are all over their state, all over a certain region, wherever you're providing service. So I can edit appointments, cancel, and mark as completed, and do all sorts of things, and just start right from here. I can also chat with 
with my client right from the platform. So I don't need to use my personal cell phone for texting. This is a really great feature where in this example, my client was having a hard time uh, filling out the intake questionnaire, even though it's pretty straightforward, you know, all clients may not be the most technologically savvy um, and you can just help them for whatever reason right away. Um, there's so much that she can track and that we can chat about. So I've kind of focused on energy level as something important, um, but I can populate that with a lot of other types of things. I can search through conversations. So messaging with your client is fantastic. I mentioned not accepting insurance. So when it comes to payments, um, I was able to set up my payment with Stripe, which is a secure payment system. It's so easy to get yourself set up. And if you already use Stripe with other um, providers for your business, so let's say uh, professional grade supplements or um, other areas you may be accepting payment through Stripe, it's even easier to link it up with Nutrium. So that was the case for me. So let's say um, payment has not been received, although the system allows you to set a filter that payment is due at the time of booking. So personally, I always do that. That's a big lesson learned for a new person in practice. Um, but let's say for whatever reason, you didn't have that enabled or it just didn't happen. I can choose my sample client here. Um, this actual client, I should say, um, and you know, which service uh, am I requesting payment for, right? So let's say we had a follow-up and she hasn't paid yet. I've set my pricing. Um, now there are fees, like with any service, there's also taxes. Um, so sometimes you'll see um, you know, a difference in what you're charging and what you're receiving, but that's gonna be true for any system uh, that you're using to accept payment. Um, and so I can go ahead and request this payment by email um, and that request was successful and and then she'll receive that and, and be able to put that in right away. Um, another aspect about um, Nutrium and the fact that when you're not accepting insurance, right, one of the things you think about is referrals. A lot of dietitians and nutritionists will get the referrals from being listed in the insurance provider network. However, there are a lot of other ways to get referrals. And as we already saw, your website and blog is an important tool. And part of why this is so important is that it's optimized for SEO. So you can get referrals through search engine optimization that you're not paying for and you're not trying to teach yourself to save money because it is very um, challenging to really understand how it works and optimize. So by setting up your website, you're gonna drive referrals um, as well as have something really professional looking to impress your current clients. So I think that those are some ways that Nutrium is helping to solve for the practitioner who's not looking to accept insurance in their practice. And I find that ability to only have and only be paying for what I need is something that's really valuable um, when starting out, but also as a, a seasoned business owner as well. Now I'm gonna show you some of the awesome capabilities within nutritional analysis, meal plan, and template development that you can use individually with your clients to boost their customer experience, and you can use as a whole nother arm to drive revenue for your private practice. So if you are working as a consultant for a consumer packaged good company, like a brand, let's say, launching a new um, protein bar or low FODMAP snack. If you are doing some consultation for a restaurant for nutrient analysis or for other types of projects where a business would like an expert nutritionist to provide either analysis or generate menus, meal plans, or other versions of validated evidence-based nutrient analysis, this software, Nutrium, is perfect for all of that. So working with your clients, working with businesses, you're gonna really highlight your expertise and it's gonna be easy for you to use and such a better experience from the user experience, like how it looks and feels to you compared to a lot of traditional tools that we all know about that have existed for a really, really long time. So. You can see on the nav bar here on the left, I've 
brought us into food. So this interacts with the USDA database. There are so many foods in here, right? So I can start looking for like uh, tomatoes and see, you know, before I've even hit enter, right? So much pops up. And so let's say I wanna analyze an individual food or I'm building a recipe or I'm actually building out an entire template. I can add new foods. So let's say there's a branded food that's for whatever reason, you know, not in the database. I can do common measures here. Um, per 100 grams so I could go ahead and plug in something new that was here and be able to have that analysis um, saved and ready to use anytime that I want to pull it. So this is really great, really easy. You can again search from your own foods from uh, the most up-to-date USDA database. You can choose the filters for how this shows to you. So you know if you really want to focus on fiber, you're going to want that to be right here on this home screen and keep it easy. If it was you know sodium your client has an issue with, you're going to highlight these, right? So you can continue to filter uh, the analysis component for whatever suits you and or your client. Um, I can add in recipes, as I mentioned. This was a great way to do this in my blog. It's super easy to build. Um, you know, so you can create a new recipe here. I'll show you really quickly. I can add a photograph. I can duplicate it, print it out. Um, you can see all these great things. So, you know, I can name my recipe, uh, you know, summer toma tomato, you know, salad. I can add a description. I can start to put in the time. If I want to add the weight, I can. You could, you know, change this into all kinds of measures. You can skip it. If you want to say how many portions, you know, this makes 12 servings, you can put that in. And then I can start to put my ingredients in here. So let's say I need to add in, you know, olive oil. Well, here it comes up right away. And I'm going to put in, um, there's one tablespoon of this. I'm going to add that. And you're going to start to see the analysis happening here. Um, so now this is going to start to highlight already for me how my recipe is looking in terms of the macronutrient balance. I can see lots of micronutrients. There, I can put in directions and cooking methods. There is just a lot to populate that happens really fast. It's really easy. So now I'm going to pop down here and show you some of the templates. There are a lot of meal plan templates already built in that you can use as they are or you can go ahead and edit or create your own. You can share these out. So let's say, for example, I'm working with an athlete and I know they need their pre and post workout meals and snacks built in. So this is already planned. I can, let's say I love this one as is, I can share it to my clients. I can edit it if I want to. I can see the breakdown again of the macronutrients. So I know for an athlete, carbohydrates are an important fuel source. So that's well represented. And I can go on in here and accept this as is, or I can change it and create a new one for myself. Um, so you can see the analysis right away. I mean, this really helps me as the nutrition professional understand. So within fats, we know, for example, less inflammatory healthy fats are going to be most important, particularly for an athlete. So the visual nature of me being able to understand this breakdown absolutely helps me communicate it more effectively to my client. And I think the micronutrient information is incredibly important to supporting the health and wellness for our clients. So these are templates and um, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to my big list of them simply to show you that there are pages and pages of templates already built in. So high protein, high fiber, gluten-free, gluten-free, dairy-free, all kinds of vegetarian, vegan, um, low residue. So there's a lot in here already built in for you. You can also um, further customize by um, template by condition. So if you wanted to look uh, at a diabetes template or just created for a general healthy lifestyle or your client who has high cholesterol. There's so much already built in here for you that you don't need to sit there, you know, pulling your hair out, stressing that you need to create from scratch. So the templates are incredible. Equivalence is essentially a way of building in a substitution list. So you can easily um, drop these into the meal plans that you create and make it easy for your clients to see the substitutions that they, they can go ahead and enjoy and use. Um, as I mentioned, 
you know, looking at recipes for a business, you could create those in here. So let's say a restaurant or a gym that has a cafe wants to hire you to analyze the smoothies that they're selling. You can create those as new recipes, you can build those analyses, and you can export them right to your client and go ahead and use that as your deliverable. So I find the nutrient analysis and meal plan features to go beyond what you're going to provide for your one-to-one -one client. And that's something as a business owner, uh, particularly someone interested in non-traditional going beyond the one-to-one, -one, this is extremely valuable. And I personally am not aware of other systems uh, that would allow me to do this at such an economical rate for me as a business owner. Thank you so much for joining me on this tour of Nutrium, I would encourage you to check it out and see what you think. The team is adding new features all the time, so I'm constantly learning more about it as well. So take care, thank you.